Welcome back for the seventh day of the Minecraft Hardcore Challenge in January 2015. Um, this is John Fowl, and we've got some uh, trading to do today. So last time, if you remember, we uh, are here in our bakery. We made our pumpkin pie, our first pumpkin pie. We made a couple of cakes, um, some bread. Uh, so we have wares to sell out here. Um, make a little more bread in case I am get hungry. Um, but our cake shop, our sweet shop, uh, at least as far as sweet goes in Minecraft, is up and running. So, Michael, we are making it sweet. Now, <clears throat> my next goal, um, other than expanding the bakery, which I'll do a little bit of work on right now, is um, to get some sweet tools. Uh, so I think we got a guy here. He takes 18. Hey, you, come back. There you go. I think this is a guy. Efficiency one axe and a knockback sword. And he's got a good price there. 17 coal. Okay, let me, let me go look at some of these other prices. So grab my emeralds here. And let's take a look. Some of these guys' prices. I really want to find a 16 coal. Maybe we have a couple of um. So he's 18. Oh, butcher. What does he take coal to? No, not yet. I'd have to unlock him. There's no way I'm ever unlocking the butcher. Um, iron axe for seven emeralds. No, thank you. Uh, 18 coal. Probably want to unlock him just to see what his other trades are, but we'll do that later. <coughs> we can get some emeralds from those guys eventually. Fisherman, there we go. 16 coal from this fisherman. Nice. And then if we unlock you, let's see what kind of fishing rod he gives us. Oh, this is unbreaking two rod. That's not terrible. This weapon smith takes 19. Well, the other guy takes 18 and is already unlocked. This fisherman takes... Oh, he's on breaking two rod also. Hmm. So this is a guy I can trade with right now. Do that. And then... An emerald for an efficiency one diamond axe and... Anybody who's watched my videos knows I do like a diamond axe. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. <coughs> and since that's his last trade, I'm also very popular in this village now. Um, I think there's something about doing the uh, final trade on villagers that lets your reputation increase in the village. Um, not exactly sure of how the mechanic works, but... Um, uh, it does good things for you. I think it lets them reset their trades more often for you. Uh, certain things like that. So now, look at this. We have a diamond axe and a diamond shovel. And, uh, yeah, I think I'm making it pretty sweet, Michael. You gotta have to tell me. Um, we want our diamond sword, though. And to do that, uh, we either need string or lots and lots of coal. Um... And we have lots of iron. That's the other thing these guys will take. Uh, not you, though. I might have to unlock their first trade, so we might need to go get some more coal before... Um... So he'll take seven. Well, let's go ahead and do that. That gives us some emeralds to play with. <coughs> the armor... Yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna gonna unlock these guys using uh, using emeralds. So we'll take one more uh, trip down to the mines. <coughs> Look, he's they're leaving us bread too. Our economy is doing well. I do think actually that has something. That whether they're leaving you food, it's kind of nice to, to know. Okay, so we've been down this mine quite a bit and pretty much tapped it out. Um, but there's another one over here. Uh, is that too close? No, okay. 
uh, in the hills that we can go explore today. Oop, I did not mean to do that. So let's just drop some stuff off at our cake shop. <coughs> we'll drop our emeralds off. Definitely our sugar. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> and we'll take um, <coughs> our new and advanced weaponry. Uh, let's grab a little bit of cobble. Uh, one piece, <laughs> just to hold a slot on the bar. And let's head over to our cave. There's a cave. I think it's an entrance right here. Nice. Okay, let's uh, head down and see what we can find. Splits off in a couple directions. Got some coal here. Okay, we've got uh, baddies. Okay, no, no, no. Okay, okay, now stand right in front of them. Ah, uh, come on. There you go. One more time. One more time. Come on. Ah. Uh, catch up, skeleton. Oh, well. Tried to get my record, but it was, uh... Yeah, you need to be able to dance around a little bit, and I was not, um, willing to die for my record there. <laughs> I don't even have another diamond to get, um, a jukebox, so... Okay, lots of coal. We will... Oh, and sneaky, sneaky. Bad guys down there. All right, let's carve this coal out while we're sitting here. That guy's trying to path to me. He's below me. The worst thing about those guys trying to... Oh! <laughs> Gonna say it's not that he can get to me because I didn't think he could, but uh, yeah, he could right here. Um, it's that you don't hear the creepers coming when you do that. Okay. Careful, careful. We need this coal. Diamond axe is nice. I'd love to get uh, a diamond pickaxe. Um, no, that didn't work. Tried. Looks like this wraps around back to where we came from. But more coal. Yeah, this is a way to just crank it out. Could make really big farms. Uh, we certainly did that in uh, Merchant of Minecraft and did a ton of trading with villagers. Um, but I'm thinking in this challenge, because I'm trying to gear up, I need to trade with the right kind of villager. Uh, we don't have a, a farmer to get a ton of emeralds on, and all the other villager types, I think coal and iron is actually the best, quickest way to go to get the vi get the emeralds we need before the end of the challenge. <clears throat> so we are going to grind out the coal. here, it's plentiful, and this is Minecraft, so we are mi we're just being a miner this month. Uh, a mi mining merchant. Okay, so that is up to the surface, as is that. Let's uh, take care of that guy. Ah, look at me.
I knew I was going to do that. <laughs> I was like trying to get creative and be and uh, put that torch there, but I'm like, I am going to knock that off. And sure enough, <laughs> when I do, I knocked it right off. Sometimes the shortcuts we take don't really work. <clears throat> so I will say, one of the things I regret about this, the one thing I regret about this... <coughs> oh, excuse me. Ooh. Um about MHC sometimes is that it doesn't always make sense to set up the automatic kind of farms um, that you would do if you were going to live in this world for a longer period of time. You know, like an automatic pumpkin farm would be really cool. There are some ways you can have the... when the pumpkin grows it activates a piston by putting a redstone signal through it. Very simple knocks the pumpkin off, but you need, <clears throat> they're the type of farms that, uh, one, um, take a while to build, you know, and I need to go get the redstone and all the other stuff in them, and then secondly, uh, you know, Michael has the no AFK <laughs> farming, and to be honest, most of the reason those things grow, you either have, if you have them in your spawn chunk, I guess, but, uh, you know, to be to get the num to get the volume that you want, and make it worth setting up. It's usually something you set up and then you AFK. Um, just you know, turn turn your computer on, put yourself in a safe zone, and uh, oops, I didn't have another pickaxe. Okay, well I will in a minute. Mm, let's do it there. I have all the stuff to make a pickaxe. Um, yeah, and that type of uh, farm, when you have, only have uh, eight or nine Minecraft days, um, <laughs> you'd sit there waiting for the farm to produce, uh, and you would be better off doing other things with your time uh, during those nine days. Unless you can build something really quick in the first day or something that can produce for eight days while you're doing your other work and then come back and get the results. So I'm trying to figure that, balance that stuff a little bit in the future. <laughs> we got stacks. Stacks and stacks here. No iron, though. This uh, is really just a coal trip. Uh, we need... Usually, we, I'd like to get a little iron just in case they lock their coal trades. Um, but there are a bunch of guys I haven't, uh, you know, they didn't have good coal prices, so I didn't unlock them yet. Um, I am going to do that. I want to, you know, take a look at what the inventory is in the village. And uh, just doing one trade with them. The first trade always unlocks something, so it's worthwhile to do that first trade and see what, what comes next. And then if it's something useful... Yeah, we got a diamond shovel. Let's use it. No, there's no more coal back there anyway, so let's move on. Dead end. Okay. Okay, we got we got a good haul, and uh, I don't want to bore you guys with mining every episode. I'm going to do a little mining, a little trading. So let's uh, say we explored this area fairly thoroughly. Grab this last vein here, and then we'll go out and do some trading uh, before it turns over to the end of day seven. I've got my, uh, certainly getting levels up to level 25. That's nice. I uh, don't think I'll be enchanting this month. I don't really plan on one of the, one of my goals was to gear up without ever going down to diamond level. I haven't gone down at all yet, and don't plan to. Wow, this is a dangerous spot. Run away! Oh, he hit. He did hit. Come on. Record? There you go. Come on, you can do it. Record, record? No? Oh, blows up the other guy. Oh, you're useless. Gosh, where are all these creepers coming from?
Ah, get away. Couldn't get to my sword there. I got a diamond axe to harvest my pumpkins. Hehe, <laughs> nice. Alright. Harvest some sugar cane here. Oh no, 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 no. Whoops. Darn it. Screwing up harvesting sugar cane. All right, let's go see where our guys are. So we got some guys in here. Let's go take a look. So this is a weapon smith. Um, we will unlock his first trade and see what he gives us. Okay. So now we've got unbreaking two. Not very good. Let's see if we can unlock your next trade. Yes, nice. Well, at least he was nice. Unbreaking one axe. Looting one. Oh, that is an awesome sword. Um, because I can trade with him a few times. I can end up with a looting three sword. I am actually going to... Uh, well, my guys are safe. You don't need to do anything with them now. That's the leather worker. Leather worker. So I need to unlock him using emeralds to get to uh, a saddle at some point. But we don't need to do that now. Here's the fisherman. Uh, he's unlocked, right? Yeah, all the way to his unbreaking rod. That I can't really. I might get an unbreaking fishing rod at some point, but let's be honest. Not. Well, it could be the most valuable thing. <laughs> Uh, I'd rather have a nice fishing rod, though. Okay, armorer. This is a guy I want for sure. Because I can take an emerald off of him. He will give up a chest plate, which is not great. But uh, if I do it again, get the particles. Nice, he gave it up right away. I can get a diamond chest plate, unbreaking one. Nice. Okay. So that armor is worth unlocking. This is the looting one guy. Okay. Now, we don't know what he does yet, so let's uh, check this weapon, Smith. Bane of arthropods. No th thank you, anthropods. Trade one at a time. There we go. What have you got? Efficiency two. Bane of anthropods two. Yeah. I've already got a, a golden axe. Sorry, buddy. Okay. Um, I might just go look for the guy with the best price then. Uh, one of these guys takes coal for 16. I think it's one of the fishermen. Hey. Hey, you. No, thank you. Yeah, it's you. I'm going to take four emeralds from you. Thank you. He will refresh because I have a... I'm pretty sure that's because I have a good reputation in the village. Yeah, we do not want to deal with a creeper. So let's, uh... Oh, dodge. Nice dodge, creeper. Truly outstanding. There we go. And uh, that's about the end of the day. We got um, ten emeralds. Not quite ready to make our other trade. But uh, we're getting there. Oh, don't shoot my villagers. Okay, we'll get away from him. Skeleton standing outside the gates. Uh, we'll have enough uh, sugarcane to trade with the villagers soon. So we will be able to uh, <coughs> make another trade. But that will do it for day seven of the MHC. We've got uh, diamond gear on the way. Got our diamond axe and shovel. We'll definitely get diamond sword and some diamond armor. That will be a goal. We're making it sweet here. I'll talk to you next time. Bye for now.